Okay. Hello, everybody. I got myself a uh, holster and a gun belt off from eBay. Because the other one was a little big and I had to run a belt to the holster to hold it up on me. This one here is smaller. I can get it around me. And it stays where I want it. But, as stiff as this leather is, it needs some moisture. So, I thought I'd put some oil into it. You can either use mink oil, most of your gun oils, uh, you have to read on there if it's good for leather or not. But uh, I'm pretty well pleased with this. It almost matches in color. I got it from two different places. But I'm happy. Because the belt fits me around the middle and not droop down around my falls down around my ankles. The loops here are for 45 Colt cartridges. And I've already checked the u birdie and it fits in here, but it's snug. So, what I'm going to do is take a uh, product. I'm not allowed to give names here because I'm not sponsored by them. But, uh, I'm sure if I were... <laughs> I'd uh, gladly uh, be singing the praises of their product because I like it. But you know what? I don't have their permission to do so, so I'm not going to get a black eye from them or give them a black eye if they don't like what I use their product for. <laughs> but I'm adding some moisture to this leather as you can tell some parts of it got dark right away because it was uh, <laughs> needing it and with that I probably should take this sucker outside onto the pavement hold on a minute okay I brought it out into the garage so that we can uh, spray some of this on there pretty uh, heavily. I almost said the dirty L word, liberal lake. Oh. <laughs> this way the leather can absorb the moisture from the oil and be a little more flexible. And it also darkens the leather up a little bit. I'm going to spray some on the inside too because that's where the revolver goes. And I'm going to set that back over there. Slide back that way. There's a spot I missed. <laughs> And now I can take the rag and wipe it in. There we go. Plus, this gives the belt and holster a little character, too. Yeah. 
give them a little time, they'll have some use markage. <laughs> hmm. Alrighty. Wipe some of that off of there. How about that? I'm glad I did this outside. Woo! Definitely do it in a well-ventilated area. Whew. Otherwise, you're going to be gagging. Well, let's take a look at this in a little bit. Okay, I brought it back in the house, and you can tell that it's definitely a different color than what it was when we first started. Now, I'm going to show you something else. I'm going to fit the birdie into the uh, into the holster. I wanted to show you that it, it is empty. There is no brass on that cylinder. There we go. Slide that in like so. And it's a nice tight fit. There's no bullets in the belt, so there's no bullets whatsoever near this gun. So it won't go boom. For all those that worry about accidents while videoing. <sighs> well, I thought I'd show you what the holster looks like with the Uberti in it on the belt looks pretty good to me it's a double loop uh, holster and from what I hear a little more period correct okay well thank you for watching enjoy your evening and we'll talk with you later bye bye